Hey everybody, Prepper Nurse One here. Today is, oh, excuse me. Today is Thursday. It is the 10th of February, 2022. Saving so got the year right. Good thing, right? <clears throat> so we had a lot of meltage here at the homestead yesterday. Today it's back to snowing a little bit. Uh, but we'll we'll take that melting snow when we get it. We'll, I have no issue with that whatsoever. Uh, but uh, so anyway, obviously it's overcast today as you can see. Um, and it is snowing. So one of those kind of days. So all right, we're going to talk about inflation. The predicted inflation for January was 7.2%. And it came in at 7.5% higher than they had anticipated. It is the highest rate since 1982. I want you to put that into perspective. A few years ago, uh, not a good sign at all, and especially coming in higher than they thought. <clears throat> We're definitely in a uh, situation which is not good. Not good at all. And... Uh, just uh, moving forward, it's definitely something to be very, very concerned about. Uh, you look at, like I said, prices continue to go up, up, and up. But the one thing that is not continuing to go up is our pay, which is, you know, the uh, cost of living uh, is just getting crazy. It's absolutely getting crazy. So uh, these are things that we need to pay attention to because they will affect you directly. <laughs> You know, uh, just like the cost of gasoline. I don't know if you guys have seen the gasoline prices. Uh, we are now up here. I just saw at the gas station the, the other day. We're up to 365 now. Uh, it just continues to go up. We were at 352. Um, from went from 352 to 362, and now we're up to 365. It's just insane how they just continuously are adding on, adding on, adding on to the prices of everything. Um, I did, I'm going to actually, I'll, I will tell you this too real quickly. So, took the bandage off uh, from my new tattoo yesterday. Uh, I will if you guys want to check it out. I haven't po posted it yet, but Heather just took a picture of it today and uh, looks good. And so uh, I will be posting that on Twitter. Instagram, and I'll probably run over to Facebook and throw it on my main page on Facebook. I won't put it on the Prepper Nurse One page on Facebook, but uh, or maybe I will, I don't know. But anyway, so Heather took a picture of it, and uh, looks good. Looks good. So healing up well. Um, not any kind of pain with it whatsoever. Um, I'm a back sleeper. <laughs> so uh, no issues with sleeping last night at all on it at all so yeah uh, did really well I mean she had uh, a light hand which is good uh, I've had guys do tattoos before where they're very heavy-handed but she did a real light touch and uh, she did it I thought she did a great job and uh, you know she banged it out I mean it was a half an hour and that tattoo was done so that was a cool thing as well but so anyway so that's that's taken care of uh, like it's probably in the well, it's snowing, so it's got to be at least 32. <laughs> Could be high 20s, high 20s, low 30s today. So we had 40 something yesterday, which was nice because, like I said, a lot of snow started melting yesterday, and uh, we would like to continue to see that happening. I think tomorrow's supposed to be like 40 as well, so we'll see what happens. We're just kind of trying to grind it out, get through this freaking time of year but you know, like I said every day we get closer to spring so that is a good thing and that's what we're looking for we're just looking for just let's get it done so when we start to see in the driveway and you start seeing the stones in the driveway you're like okay that's a good sign but no yesterday was a really good day for melting snow and so uh, definitely uh, was happy about that so anyway I hope everybody is you know, continue to pay attention, guys, to what's going on. I mean, you know, there's a lot of concern, obviously, right now. Uh, people are concerned with what's going to happen with uh, Ukraine. Uh, also, obviously, Taiwan, those are concerns. But I think people start need to start paying more attention to what's happening at home. 
uh, you know, like I said, inflation is getting out of control. Uh, like I said, the worst since 1982. Uh, you have gas prices that just continue to go up and up and up. You have uh, fuel cost or fuel heating fuel or heating oil. God, I wish I could speak today. Propane. All those things have just gone up ridiculously high. Also with that, you're talking food prices are just out of control as well. Uh, the cost of electric, uh, if you are on the grid, that just continues to go up as well. The only thing that's not going up is your paycheck. Uh, that is the one thing that is absolutely not going up. So those are things to pay attention to. Uh, just, you know, keeping an eye on things moving forward. Uh, it is... Uh, definitely definitely concerning let's put it like that very very concerning so all right um what was i going to say to you guys god i was going to tell you something and i can't think of it right now for whatever reason but i am cold today for some reason so it's got to be in the 20s it's got to be in the 20s up here <laughs> if it's 30 30 feels pretty good 40s t-shirt weather so I know you folks in the south are probably like you're out of your mind, but no, when, when you deal with sub-zero temperatures and it's cold and it's nasty and it's not any fun, uh, 40 feels like a heat wave. And we were actually talking about that, Heather and I were talking about that yesterday, and we were like, isn't that a shame when 40 feels great? I'm like, absolutely, but what are you going to do? So... Um, I'm obviously not going to be starting seeds um, in the greenhouse this spring because as of March 1st, uh, the property is going to go on the market. So, uh, you know, we're not going to do that up here. Uh, once we get down south, we're going to try to get something, you know, going. Uh, I definitely want to get a garden going down there. So, I mean, I have... I have contacts to make. I gotta t know who to talk to, and and I will talk to uh, the people that I bought the property from, because you know they've been there forever and a day, so they know everybody. So uh, I will be talking with them, and uh, seeing who the contacts of people to be able to pick up, you know, um, composted cow manure uh, and all those type of things. Hey, 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 Pandora! Look at their little fluffy tails. <laughs> they have so much fun they get out here and they play and they play and they play it's good for them but uh what what's going on beautiful girl that's daddy's girl that's daddy's girl oh see pandora's like wait a minute wait a minute what baby what are you doing huh you good baby yes you are <laughs> they'll come in after playing like this, guys, and they will crash. They will crash so hard. But uh, they have they have a good time. They're good company for each other. I'm going to tell you what. If you have a dog, you better have more than one uh, because it's like they're such great entertainment for each other. I think it is an awesome thing to see. But anyway, I want to hear your guys' feedback on the inflation situation, okay? I know, you're a good girl. Yes, you are. A good girl. I know, baby. So, um, I want to hear what your thoughts on are, where we headed, how bad is it going to get, is it going to get worse? Um, I definitely want to hear. See, all the snow is off of their roof now, and most of it is off of ours. <laughs> so... There was a big crash through tonight. I heard more stuff coming down um, last night. Uh, really quickly, I do want to mention my website. We have the Prep and Nurse One community there, which is a resource that we have set up for you guys to be able to connect with like-minded people. It is free to join, uh, but you do have to register. Uh, the, but there's no credit card information asked when you register. All right. Uh, check out the message boards. Look for people in your state or your country to be able to connect with like-minded people. Also on my website, we have the Forefathers, which is a CBD and hemp store. Uh, definitely take advantage of that as well. If you go to my website, preppernurse1.com, you will see the Forefathers logo. If you click on that, it will take you to their website. Once you are on their website, if you decide to make a CBD or hemp purchase, um, when you check out, make sure you use a discount code PREPPERNURSE1. You will save yourself 15% on your purchase. 
Hold on one second, guys. Head. Grab the puppies, please. Thank you. So, um, also on my website, we have the Legacy Freeze Dried Foods. Uh, again, PrepperNurse1.com. You go in there, you click on store, it will drop down, and you will see Legacy Foods. Uh, you click on that, it will take you to the store within the website. 25 year shelf life, GMO free, gluten options available as well. Oh, we got to do the thing with, with Hella. Hold on. Uh, gluten options as well. Uh, it is also vegetarian. And. Uh, there are beef and chicken options that can be purchased separately. Where's my girl? Where's my baby? <laughs> That's a good girl. Good girl. Go. All right. Everybody in. Everybody in. All right. Uh, <laughs> too funny. All right, guys. So, um... Definitely take advantage of that. Freeze-dried food is a good thing to have in your long-term food storage. All right, so I am going to end this video. Uh, I will be doing a second video later, probably go up around 8 o'clock. Uh, remember, we are all in this together. We are one race called the human race. As soon as we can figure that out, we're going to be in much, much better shape. We have to stop letting them divide us over race, religion, political affiliation, the vaxxed, the unvaxxed. Uh, definitely, you know... Let's focus on things that are important, not trivial things that really don't matter. Also remember to hug and kiss the ones that you love. Tell them every single day. Tomorrow is not guaranteed. We never know what's going to happen in life, so it's really important that we tell the people that we care about every day how we feel. Last but not least, STD. Step thing in day. One step at a time, one thing at a time, and one day at a time. Whatever you are trying to do, whatever you're trying to accomplish, you can do it. The only one that can stop you from reaching your goals is you. That's it. Nobody else. Stay positive, stay away from the negativity, and you're going to be just fine. All right? I will see you all later. I hope everybody's having a great day. Prepper Nurse One, out for now.